First episode of Meat Machine. Gonna do a little bacon on a little mini green egg. As we're watching the playoff game tonight. Our uh, blazing gridiron sitting over there in the corner with the dog staring at it. A little bit chilly out tonight. But uh, we're gonna use the, uh, the new bison lighter that they sent me to review. So in a couple minutes, I'm gonna start up the green egg with the new little bison lighter that they sent me to review. So stay tuned. Here's the bison air lighter. It's a nice little, can open up some bottled beer with it. Got some lump on the egg. Gonna use this guy to light everything up here. Here we go. First use with the new bison. Get that nice and hot in there. It's like little fireworks going off. Let that go for another 20 seconds or so. Yowza! Get hot. That was pretty crazy. Probably another 30 seconds or so and she should be lit. This is the uh, Bison Air Lighter. I want to thank Bison for sending this to me. For my first official view with official review with the bison. You can see the fire in there. Probably in a second or two to just let this go. Then I'm gonna be making some a couple of different things on here tonight using my egg genius that BGE sent out. And uh, we'll get some more reviews going. Looks like it's lit up pretty good. Alright. Look at that. Not bad. With a little mini bison. That worked pretty awesome right there. That fan was pretty powerful. You can see it right there, really going away to town. Let that burn for a couple minutes. I'm gonna close it off, get the BG on there, and I will uh, come back in a second. All right, I'm back. I got the little BG in here. Set the temperature here for 275. I'm gonna make a couple things on here for dinner tonight. And I just want to shout out the BGE for the Egg Genius they sent out. We'll get a nice little deal on that coming soon. But I dial in, I actually used the clip, put it to the actual dome temperature. And then make sure this is right here set. I got it closed, but let me set it open. There we go. Got that set open. Just got to close it a little bit. Make sure some air is coming out. And uh, we'll be back. That lighter did the job. Yes, Got it sitting over here. Ah, 30 seconds it was lit, and then a minute with air, so about a minute and 30. Normally I use some lighter sticks, and uh, don't truly appreciate the smell I get from the lighter sticks. So this is definitely, seems like it's going to do a better job. Fire's lit. Fire's lit. NFL football's on, and I'll be back in a couple minutes. Looks like we're coming up the temp pretty nice here. The actual Flame Boss app is showing very similar temperatures. And again, I don't have it on the grill grate that normal most people do. I actually set it up and put it on the actual end of the temperature probe. So they, at the end of the day, they should be equal. Calibrated this a while back, so we should be good. Smoking away so slightly, getting pushed into the fan. And it looks like we're on our way to cooking some chicken in here. I got my lovely assistant over here to help me with the aerial views with the Tello drone. Look out for some videos coming from that. Thank you, DJI, for the drone. And uh, right now we're looking at about 200 degrees. You can see here some smoke coming out. Definitely smoking up pretty good. Looks like we got some smoke coming. No, the seal of the egg is good. It's definitely coming from the top rim looking pretty good. One of the things I normally do on these cooks is I use a battery backup because you never know in Florida if you get a battery surge. 
And last thing you'd want is my BGE Egg Genius to go down and then because of some power glitch or something else. So I like to use a battery backup when I'm using the, the Blazin as well as using the Mini Meat Machine right here. And I'll stay tuned for some more. My assistant is filming as well. The egg is almost up to temp here. I'm trying to get the 350. I'm sitting at 300 right now. I just want to show you guys this flame here. It's pretty impressive. It's a nice little flamethrower we got here. Elon Musk got nothing on this one. A little bison right here, a little air lighter. It's definitely doing work for the meat machine, the mini meat machine. We're going to do some chicken breast on here, indirect cooking. Instead of using the plate setter over there, we're actually going to just do it on the pizza stone since we made pizza a couple weeks ago. That video is coming soon as well. All right, we'll see you in a minute. All right, looks like we are up to ten. Got the Yeti wine cup. The wine in there. Review coming soon. Looks like we are sitting directly at 350. The uh, BGE Egg Genus is doing its job. I see uh, thin white smoke, so it looks like it's time to bake. And it's almost chicken time. That's what we're putting on tonight for our bison check, our review video. We throw the uh, temp probes in here, and then we can get up the temperature, correct temp. The uh, little BGE gives me two temperature probes here. Alright, let's open this up. Looking pretty in there. It's nice and smoky. Throw this on right in the middle. Get these up here. Uh, my wife is yelling at me for something probably I didn't do. Uh, I just got notification that the chicken should be done. Again, this is a continuation of the bison air lighter review. Looks as if the chicken is done. Cooked at 30 minutes for 350 degrees for an internal temp of 167. Got to hit that 67 for the 67 meat machine channel. Going to use my Thermapro 4 to check the temp. Review coming soon for that as well. Shout out to Thermapro for sending the, the uh, temp gauge out to us here. Let's see what we got here. It's supposed to be an instant read. Well, it's not too instant right there. Maybe a couple more degrees here. Check this side out. Let's see where the probes are. Ooh, that's cooked there. Check this spot right here. Looks like we're almost done. Just a little bit on the outside needs it. Maybe I should flip these over. I don't know. Depends. Let me know in the comments below if I should have flipped these. Let's see what we got here. Flip them over and we'll be done. Just about done. And again, just want to let you know that this cook started off as a review of the bison air lighter, which within a minute and 20 seconds lit my mini meat machine, the Mini Max Big Green Egg. 
And then uh, within this review, we saw a couple things we were doing here. Cooking some chicken, reviewing the big green egg, egg genius that they sent us, the uh, Thermomark Ford pen that they sent out to us, all within the review of the bison. But I can say, normally I normally used the big green egg lighter charcoal sticks that they would send out and light those up, throw it in, 10 minutes later I'd close the lid. This is the first time that within probably a minute and a half, two minutes, I just strapped on the BGE Egg Genius and it was up the temp, kicked off, ready to go. So I'm gonna end this review here. I definitely would suggest you all like like the YouTube channel, 67 Meat Machine. Go out and get yourself a bison air lighter. This thing worked amazingly. This is way better than the flamethrower that Tesla has out there. This thing is pretty awesome. And have a great day. Happy meat machine. And dinner is complete. That is your review of the Bison Air flamethrower. I suggest go out and get yourself ones. Click the link below and get one. And I appreciate you watching and subscribing to the 6-7 Meat Machine. Happy Meat Machining.